Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Just got done marching in the 4th of July Hillsboro Parade as Captain America, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to uh, show you my outfit. So, like most of these, we're just going to start with the bottom and go up. Uh, the boots are just regular old combat boots. Nothing special. I got them off of Amazon for like 40 bucks. It's the, uh, they call these the gaiters that make the boot. And it's basically just a leather wrap made from white sheep leather. And the majority of this costume was also made by white sheep leather. The entire uh, uniform that I'm wearing, including the belt, is from white sheep leather. leather. You can get it from there for uh, somewhere around $300, and it's an amazing deal. Uh, it's very textured, it's stretchy, it's breathable. It is very easily the best Captain America outfit I have ever owned. And this is my sixth one, so that's saying something. Uh, the gloves and the harness are from a company called Leather Fashion Valley. You can also get these from White Sheep Leather. The harness from them is just fine. However, the gloves have a manufacturing defect in them, so I would not recommend getting gloves from White Sheep Leather because the wrap right here goes the wrong way, which means tightening them is kind of out of the question. I don't know why they designed them the way that they did, but that's what it is, so I would get your gloves from Leather Fashion Valley. This shield, I've had multiple shields during my career. This is kind of my go-to shield for charity work because it can get beaten up by kids and you don't really have to worry about the paint scratching or if it gets ruined, it's fairly cheap to replace. All of my metal shields are at least 300 bucks. This one is about half that at uh, 125 or so. And the brackets and leather straps on the inside are all screen accurate. This magnet right here is used to hang from the back of my harness. So I can actually hang it on my back if I want to, which is pretty awesome. And once you hear that click, it ain't coming off. And you can't even pull it off either. You have to slide it off. Otherwise, it won't move. Uh, the helmet is from a company called Jordan's Ironic Armory. You can find them on uh, Facebook. The helmet is actually uh, a latex, even though it looks like it's made out of, you know, resin or something like that. So it's very flexible. It's easy to take on and off. Um, it looks great. It's even got the, uh, where's the little metal right here? The, the metal clasp on the side is also accurate to the films. Uh, this is the Endgame version. Uh, he actually makes several different versions, one for Age of Ultron, one for uh, Winter Soldier. They all look relatively the same. They all just have like really, really minor differences. So for me, it's just one helmet for whichever outfit I want to wear. But honestly, I've gotten rid of all the other ones at this point because this one is just so amazing and comfortable. So anyway, um, if you want to put this whole outfit together, it's probably going to run you somewhere around $500. But for what you get, that's an amazing deal. So anyway, uh, that's my video for my Captain America suit. And thanks for watching and have a great day.